Good morning. This is what it looks like. It's about uh, 7 o'clock and I gotta take off. I have to go back to Lowe's and get some more stuff. I thought I'd go to Lowe's and get there kind of early. However, I need to really kind of get into my computer and take a look at the diagram. See if I can't get that uploaded to my phone. I thought bringing my computer would be an easy fix, but it's not. Uh, well, today's, like I said, Saturday. I got up this morning in hopes of getting materials, getting back here, and getting right to work. However, I took my, my computer into the Y. I went and got a shower over there and got cleaned up and uh, they allowed me to set up shop there and now that I have a little bit of experience uh, framing I realized all the things that I did wrong on the SketchUp program so from about nine o'clock in the morning till two o'clock I did nothing but fix my errors after that I went and got the proper materials for the headers and and uh, a few other things so I still have tomorrow though. Uh, I'm expecting, they're expecting some rain, but we'll see what happens. They expected rain yesterday and today, and I don't know if you can see the sky, but it's beautiful out. Well, I was feeling a little guilty because I didn't do much today. I spent all my time, like I mentioned, on SketchUp. But I want to show you what I do have done and the little bit that I did do today. This is the south facing wall. And what I'm going to do is after I get the wall up, I will install in the spring my solar oven. My plan is to have a solar oven in the kitchen, a wall oven. So when the sun comes out and goes to the south, I'm going to capture that heat. And my oven, my oven will heat up on its own to about 325 to 365 depending on the sun intensity. So I have this broken down into three pieces, uh, eight by eights. And here is where I'm building the frame for uh, the bathroom window. It's only gonna have a 10, excuse me, a, a six inch header because the window is only uh, two feet wide. So I don't need to go berserk on it and do a 10 inch header on it, that's silly. So here is the header. I still have to cut the piece in between here to make it uh, three and a half inches wide, or yeah, three and a half inches wide. So I'll get started on that tomorrow. The hope is, before I leave tomorrow, to have the other two windows, or other two walls framed out and laid up on here. And then I'm going to cover it all up and go home until next week. Hopefully next week I'm going to have my nephew here and he's going to help me erect the walls along with two of my neighbors. We'll nail them into place and I'll focus on the loft at that time and then decide if I'm going to be able to put the roof up. Um, I'm not one for heights so there's a possibility that I might contract that part out but be here of course on site when they put it up because they could whip it out in a day and be done and I may go ahead and do the trusses myself to save me a lot of money uh, but we'll see how that goes I have some scrap wood <laughs> some pellets pallets some uh, scrap wood from my neighbor scrap wood from cutting uh, so I'm going to start a little fire, grab myself an ice cold beer, and sit and relax under the stars for a while until tomorrow morning. Good morning. It's Sunday morning. And now I'm kind of racing the clock. There's a lot I have to get done before I have to take off and go back home. I have to complete the rest of the south side wall. And also do the west side wall and the north wall 
I'm not going to be erecting them or standing them today. I'm going to actually lay them down and give them all covered up and protected until I can get back here next week with a friend or two to help me erect all the walls and put up the loft. So moving forward. Oof, no coffee today. <laughs> coffee wins. It always does. But you know I'm roughing it because I have no cream. Oh, that's good coffee. Mm. Burnt mouth is a small price to pay. You know, building a house isn't quite like following the directions on building a house isn't like cooking. <laughs> Where uh, a pinch of this and a pinch of that, you gotta be dead on. I mean, you gotta be dead on in order for uh, everything to fit like a puzzle. I know that's silly, of course, right? But you know, this is three and five sixteenths. See, I keep putting my stuff down. Boy, the weather is supposed to be cloudy most of the day. I hope they got that right. It would be nice. It is three feet and five sixteenths. Two, three feet. And five sixteenths right there. Okay. Oop. This is for the window framing for the bathroom. All of my windows, I didn't buy a single one from a box store. However, it's a very good chance I'm going to get my sliding doors that goes out that will go out to the patio facing the uh, what will be the food forest. That will probably come from a store. I want a new one, you know. Out of the box with the flanges. Oh. The door I don't want to mess with. The door I just want done right. Let's see. I really gotta get in the habit of putting this stuff back, right? Well doing the framing it's kinda exciting. So here, this will be bracing for the window ledge, see? These two long ones here on each side holding up my oh, uh, header. I get one more board here that will go in the center. It's also 16 on center. So everything will be able to get nailed down. This is coming along. Sweet. There. That's pretty much the framing for the window. I still have to get a half an inch of plywood in between the uh, two uh, brown boards up there to make it about three and a half inches thick. Uh, but that's on the bottom of the truck of all my material, so that's going to kind of wait a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and keep framing it up. At this point, I have to get cut some small pieces for up here. Uh, one, two, oh, I don't know. I have to check my diagram, but quite a few of them to really brace it well. Moving along. There. And we do the same to the other side. No, it seems like it might be a time saver. Yeah, this is wasting too much of my time though. And then bring my table, of course.
just there. Right there. Nice. So you can see, hopefully you can see the, the little pieces in there. I still have to get one board going down there, but this is the framing for my window in the bathroom. Now I just gotta start nailing it down.